the Lordson Love Affair is still alive and well one year since its grand opening. Bringing in skaters from all over the Midwest. Omaha, Nebraska. And building the sport's presence right here in Des Moines. This place hasn't even feel like it's been open a year. It feels like a day. <laughs> it's a place people want to come to. Tom Miller with Skate DSM says that's what the park was designed to do. Flat concrete for beginners. It's really good for all the young shredders that are trying to, that are trying to just go big. To high-flying bowls for the advanced skaters. Miller says it's a park for all skill levels. You can really grow the sport and grow yourself as a skater throughout the park. And Lordson Skate Park can't stay out of the national spotlight. One of the sport's biggest international events, the Dew Tour, is coming back this summer. The Olympic qualifying event was held in Des Moines last year with restricted capacity due to the pandemic, but will be in full force come July. Last year, it was a bit of a scaled back version of their event. This year, it's gonna be more of their full version. Building a new generation of skaters. I got a lot better from this park, but yeah, I'm just trying to have fun and skate. And marking Des Moines as the skateboarding capital of the country. Everybody's learning something off of somebody and uh, just an all-around good environment. In Des Moines, Bo Bowman, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.